Oh, howdy all, grab yourself a beer, it's time for some part of Exile discussion. Patch 3.17 brought about a number of changes to sextants, and one of the things that they did was make it so that they're easier to trade from player to player or to store for future use. But in addition to that, they also changed the mods that could roll on them. Some mods got better, some mods got worse, some mods were removed, and some new mods were added. And one of my favourite of the new mods is this one. Maps found in areas are corrupted with eight modifiers. This saves a lot of time when you're mapping. It's not what I would term the most powerful in terms of multiplying your loot of the new sextant mods, but what it does is it saves you a lot of hassle rolling maps. Instead, apply this sextant when you've got it, and you will then just have all of your maps drop rolled for you. Sometimes you won't be able to do them, you'll have a reflect mod that your build's allergic to, or zero regen, or something really harsh like the new players have 60% reduced effective auras on them. If that's the case, that's fine, you're over sustaining maps so much that you probably don't care about having one or two maps you can't do yourself. Just a couple of quick caveats though, there are some things that can go wrong with this. Unique maps can get crangled by it. And where this Buried Solitude is probably actually better than a Vault Savatsuri. This would be disappointing if I was still at a point in Alice progression where I needed Vault Savatsuri, and this was the first one that had dropped for me and it dropped ruined. Or alternately, sometimes you can get a map that you just cannot beat that is something that was genuinely a good map. So this Steel Vault City Square map is something that very few players would be able to beat. This has Baran Citadel in it, Baran will be possessed, monsters have increased attack speed and cast speed importantly for Baran and it's 43% which is a lot. This is a really fiendishly difficult Baran map. Now there'll be plenty of players that can beat this, but a lot of players that can beat Baran will not be able to beat the incarnation of Baran that is in this map. And so if you're in that situation, you might find that sometimes it's a little bit disappointing when you get a map like this replace what would have otherwise been a clean and craftable Baran map. But all that said, I'm pretty impressed with this Sextant mod and I recommend giving it a shot. Fair warning, it's pretty rare, you probably won't find this often in SSF, but if you're in Trade League, just because it's not all that powerful, it's not something that people value all that highly. I was buying these four use ones for 10 chaos mostly, 15 use one cost me 35 I believe, and I had a couple of three use ones that I'd rolled myself. So they're all pretty, they're all pretty cheap and they're something that will just keep your mapping flowing better because all your map rolling is basically done for you. You'll just pick them off the ground already rolled. That's all I got on that. Me and Valobs have interesting results and I will see you around.